Hi, and welcome to The Magic Detective. I am your host, Dean Carnegie, and tonight is our very first episode. Now, you might be wondering what The Magic Detective show is all about. Basically, it's a brief look into the world of magic history. So, I'll be talking about things like Houdini and Harry Keller and levitations and all sorts of manner of crazy things related to the world of theatrical magic. Um, although, I only have five minutes, so you won't get all that tonight. Uh, actually, tonight we're going to be uh, exploring an escape gone wrong. Uh, escapes and magic have always been closely related since the time of Harry Houdini. And in the 1970s, the greatest escape artist alive at the time was probably a fellow by the name of Steve Baker. Steve Baker was known as Mr. Escape, and he traveled all over the world presenting his incredible escapes and one that he did uh, present was called Trial by Fire. Now, Steve presented this successfully a number of times, but uh, on this dark, cold night in Caracas, Venezuela in the mid-1970s, something went wrong. Now, this happened on live television before a live audience, so what you're going to see tonight is, uh, I don't think it's ever been seen anywhere outside of Venezuela, so it may be your first time viewing this. It's a little horrific, but uh, I hope you enjoy it at the same time. So ladies and gentlemen, please watch Mr. Escape, Steve Baker. La fira humana. Este hombre encadenado, esposado, amarrado y cubierto por todos los ángulos porque por la parte de atrás el público también se está dando cuenta y la gente de los edificios de que no hay ningún escape, va a salir por el frente. Dios quiera que todo esto salga bien, ya que estamos llevando actos de, de la vida del ser humano y de un gran peligro. Julie le dio un beso de despedida como viste Amador, le dio un beso a Steve, su esposa, le pusieron el capuchón para evitar el humo y está listo entonces, señores y señores, para que se empiece a rociar la gasolina a través por todas las tiendas de campaña por esta casa que hemos hecho de la muerte y entonces ahora el mayor va a ordenar a todos los bomberos para que proceda a colocar la gasolina y de inmediato prender el fuego. Adelante Amador. Rogamos que todo salga bien. Su casa viene mentalmente. Ya el cuerpo de bomberos empieza a incendiar la pira, mire cómo... Ahí está, señoras y señores, se está realizando en este momento. ¡Ahí está! ¡Es Steve Baker! Eh, necesitamos... Ha salido un aplauso fuerte, Amador. Steve Baker... Steve Baker... Now that was exciting, um, but something went wrong, obviously. And I talked to Steve Baker and he told me that uh, apparently the producers had wanted this to be really exciting. So along with Steve's special chemical uh, mixture that he makes up, it's a flammable uh, liquid that he prepares to, place, to, to, to be poured on the teepee, the producers decided to add five additional gallons of gasoline. Now, if you watch the, uh, the video here, watch the lower part of the teepee and you'll see the uh, gasoline actually puddling up at the lower part of the teepee. Now, that gasoline is seeping inside the teepee where, t where Steve is right now in the video. And uh, as soon as they light it on fire, not only will the outside of the teepee be burning, but it will be burning inside the teepee as well. If you watch this next clip, you watch the lower left-hand corner, and it happens very briefly when Steve bursts out of the teepee. You'll notice he doesn't hit the mat that's uh, directly in front. He's actually uh, to the side of the mat, and then he rolls away. 
This was, this was just incredible on his behalf because a second later, after he burst forth from this, uh, this uh, teepee thing, the front of it came crashing down right upon the mat where he was supposed to be. So fortunately, he got out of the way. He still received second and third degree burns. So for anybody out there that thinks uh, when you see these escapes on TV that they're, you know, set up or, you know, it's just a magic trick and there's no danger involved. Well, I have news for you. Uh, there is danger involved in this particular one. Uh, a, a lesser escape artist may have lost their life. Uh, Steve was injured, but he recovered to perform many other escapes throughout his illustrious career. Uh, by the way, if you'd like to uh, find out a little bit more about Steve Baker, you can go to his website at MrEscape.com and read all about uh, the exciting life of Steve Baker, the escape artist. Uh, that's our first episode. It's a quick one, and uh, I thank you for watching. Next week, we'll uh, have some more magic history and more exciting stuff for you. And by the way, if, uh, if you like, go check out my blog at themagicdetective.com, and you can read more about magic history there, stories that I wrote, and uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks so much.